Hey everyone, I just came out here real quick to document the fact that we got just enough snow this morning to make things look a little bit magical. I hear it, it's melting already. It's not even lunchtime yet, but can you hear the water running down the drain spouts? So I wanted to come out real quick. It just makes everything look so much better. I have to admit, a lot of the times, at this time of the year, I hate coming out to my garden because anymore we get so much rain and the fact that we live on a slope, the edges of the beds get run off in even just a little bit of a rain and it kind of makes the edges of the beds look depressing to me because you can see more mud than you can see mulch. The grass gets so squishy in certain parts that you can't really walk. But a little bit of snow, to be quite honest with you, just makes things look a little bit more magical. The winterberry hollies kind of stand out more, even though they stand out already. But they just look much brighter against the little bit of white on the ground. Even the grasses and the oak leaf hydrangea look pretty with a little bit of snow on top. Look at the beautiful red foliage with the just glistening white of the snow. I can hear water dripping everywhere. It's melting that quickly. And I honestly don't know how much more snow we're gonna get. I mean, it is, what's today? Today's December 6th. Uh, it's been relatively warm. We did get a little bit of snow yesterday morning too, but not as much as today. So that's why, and it's not even much. I mean, look, you can still see the grass. You can see my footprint. So it's not like we got a spectacular amount of snow. But like I said, it just is enough. To make everything look a little bit less depressing. To me, anyway. Just going to take a quick walk around. And look at everything in the snow. I want to see what the um, winterberry hollies up in the rain garden that have the gold berries look like because they end up looking slightly different than the winterberry hollies with the red berries. I hope the camera is picking up how pretty that snow looks against the blue gray foliage of the gray owl juniper. It's melting so quickly that some things are already devoid of snow. It's quite chilly out though. Fluffy arborvitae looks pretty. I'm starting to see the stems of the Arctic sun dogwood too. Brilliant reds, coppery oranges and yellow toward the center. Let's see if I can get over to these very heavy gold. Yeah, that looks pretty against even a little bit of the pinpoint blue and gold fall cypress that you can kind of see. I mean, they're still quite small. The very heavy gold is even quite small probably only three and a half, four feet tall. They will get, with time, six to eight feet tall. They just look pretty, even against the Panicum heavy metal, which is all brown now. Let's see what the Ilex opaca looks like with just a little bit of snow. Just a little bit remaining to highlight the red berries.
Blue Point junipers already don't have any snow left on them. You can actually tell where the colder spots of the yard are because there's more snow down here, or I should say up here, than there was down below. I'm not sure. Just making some notes for myself. I don't typically come up to this part of the yard, but this is where we have been really reforesting the area. We had these four Eastern White Pines planted earlier this year, and I just wanted to come up and get a shot of them with the snow because they really do look pretty with the snow. This one even has a pine cone, so exciting. For some reason, this one is not looking as healthy as the others. It almost like it lost its top or something. I don't see it laying around anywhere, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. But they just look so pretty with the snow, and I'm really excited for these to start to fill in up here and provide us with the screen that we wanted. The Erie Viburnum is still holding on to some of its berries. They're looking a little shriveled, but they look pretty. Kind of surprised it's melting so quickly, actually, because it's still quite chilly out, but I guess that's probably because the ground is still warmer than the surrounding air. It's amazing how well sturdy grasses hold up and with a little bit of snow. Now obviously these are no longer covered in snow, but I can definitely tell there was snow on them. But these are still really sturdy and upright. These uh, this campus morning light, which I love. That's it guys, like I said, just a really quick video. I wanted to get out here and show the snow. I'm like a little kid when it comes to snow and it just does really make everything look so pretty. Did you get snow where you live today? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.